Hey, what's good, BT Gang? And we back with another banger, man. Thank y'all so much for tuning in once again. I'm BT, and welcome to BT Sense. And before we get started today, man, I know a lot of people aren't going to click on this video, but that's just the, algor the way the algorithm goes. You know, you got to talk about like a Latafa Saad, a Latafa Kamra, or, you know, these popular these popular clones out there that gets clicks and like, like panty driver videos, stuff like that that gets clicks. I'm just letting y'all know, for those of y'all who stay clicked onto this video, you're going to get one of the best fragrances out there today. Not even just Middle Eastern, one of the best fragrances out there today. So today, I'm talking about this, man. I'm talking about uh, Cough from, uh, Ma I don't know how to say it, like Maghreb. It's from uh, Ahmed Maghrebi. Like it's, it's a Middle Eastern fragrance. It's duping. Parfum de Marley Percival, which is uh, Eric Crombie and Fitch Fierce, for those of y'all who know that one. But I'm telling you, a lot of people are not going to click on this video, but I promise you, if you stay, if you stay and watch this whole video, this this is my fav new favorite fragrance, y'all. This is my new favorite fragrance. Let me talk about it. So this smells just like Eric Crombie, Fitch Fierce. I'm going to go through the notes and, you know, we got to do that for all my note words out there. So we got red fruit, watermelon, lavender, sisal, and orange in the top. Then in our heart, we got lotus, jasmine, lily, lily of the valley, and a sea accord. Then in the bottom, we got sandalwood and broxen and white musk. Pretty much the same notes as uh, Percival. This is literally Percival just turned up to a thousand. Turned up to a thousand. I wore this to work this past week, man. And I wore it a couple other times before that, just outside running errands. I wore this to work. I thought I oversprayed because this stuff is a beast. It is a beast. Um, I thought I oversprayed. I was kind of nervous. Little did I know I walked into work with this on. Every, everybody's head literally just turned. Like everybody's head turned. It was uh, everybody. Uh, one of my female coworkers was like, oh my God, what is that? And another one was like, yeah, what is that? And I, I saw a couple of people looking at me in the back like, what is that? What is what, what is he got on? What is this? And I'm known as the fragrance guy. So they smelled a lot of stuff on me before. Like they know this. The fact that they mentioned something just shows how powerful it was. And it was to the point where I was kind of embarrassed, y'all. Like me, I'm, I'm outgoing. I'm chatty. I talk. Um, I'm confident. I got so much attention, y'all, that I was uncomfortable. Not uncomfortable, but I was just like. You know, I was shy. I, was, I didn't know what to say. Like, I was just standing there like a kid on his birthday getting sung happy birthday to. Like, I, I don't like, you know, like when you go back to your, your, a cookout or something and you got bigger or taller, and you just stand there they're like, oh, go ahead, stand up. Go ahead, show them how big you got. You just standing there smiling. They all talking about how big you got. That's how I felt, man. Like, I felt like not like I was being violated, but I was just standing there and I didn't know what to do. So, uh, honestly, though, I gay kept. I gay kept. I uh I lied to my coworkers and I told them it was Percival, which it kind of is. I didn't fully lie, but this is Percival on steroids, man. I'm telling you, the performance on and reach on this stuff is absurd, man. Um, so I at least I get at least eight hours with this, nine hours. It is in Broxen base, so you might get nose blind and stuff like that, but it should stay with uh, stay with you throughout the whole life. But it smells just like Percival. It is so good and it's so mass appealing. This is, in my opinion, uh, Parfums de Marley's Blue Fragrance. Some people say it's Setley. I think it's Percival. Percival is like all year round. Smells great. Um, it's nostalgic as well for some people. People like I talked about that fierce. Uh, Siage, I would say, is on the, uh, the larger side. It's a, what is the word? Not larger, but it's, it's a wide Siage. You get what I'm saying? It's, it's not nothing that's going to stay close to the skin whatsoever. This stuff is going to push out. But the thing about this is it has texture to it. It's like fresh. It's airy. It's, it's a, those C notes. It just like flows. And I can't even imagine how beautiful this is when it's blowing through the wind. I just, I love sitting here and smelling this. I paid $50 for this, by the way, from the Ooh store. Um, I'm really starting to pay attention more to this house because this product is so good that they got my business for a long, long time, man. I was looking for something that was mass appealing and easy reach. Um, I, I also, I'm, I'm making them a car and I'm going to start selling my bottles. This is not being sold at whatsoever, but I might end up getting a backup bottle. But I think I got this uh, recommendation from Aromatics, man. This stuff is great. But man, like I've never gotten so much attention from a fragrance to the point where I was like, okay, like y'all like chill. You feel me? <laughs> like that, like I, I don't know, man, like. 
I, I, when, when you hear stuff like this in YouTube videos, I know it's easy to think that, hey, this dude is just trying to boost his product. He's sponsored. He's, you know, because I've seen a lot of videos like this. And um, I'm, I'm, I'm here to tell y'all I'm not sponsored or anything, bro. I just bought the fragrance for my own money. I wore it. And, and that, that happened, you know. So I'm not telling y'all that's going to happen with y'all. But I'm just telling you the type of, you know, reactions that you possibly can get. It's possible. I'm not saying it's going to happen. Obviously, you got to groom and, you know, be well put together and, you know, all that good stuff. But man, I, I, I found I'm never I'm never buying Percival. Why would I ever buy Percival? This is more expensive. I get a hundred mils, good quality, better performance. Like, oh, man. Why would I ever do that? Like, honestly, bro, you probably only need like two or three sprays with this, but I'm a heavy pumper, bro. I'm a heavy sprayer, bro. So I put at least, you know, four, five, six. You feel me? Even seven. Eight, you know, sometimes like this stuff is strong. This stuff is strong. You don't have to do that. I, I just, I make a commute to work. I, I, it takes me like a 15 minute walk to work. So I kind of air out my fragrance, I guess, before I get into a, a location. But if you're not doing that, I would say tone down the sprays. Cause I feel like I add an extra spray or two to co uh, compensate for my walk to work. But uh, yeah, man, that's pretty much all I got to say about this. You can wear this any, any season, any day, any occasion, day or night. Uh, it's a, uh, I will even say, uh, one of my coworkers was like, uh, it was, it was a female. She was like, Oh, what's it called? Can I get it? So the fact that she said that, I would assume that this could be unisex and I can see this being unisex. Honestly. I mean, it has a masculine touch to it, but maybe it just smells so good that she wanted it. You know, I don't know. But I mean, if you want to wear this as a female, I think you can pull it off, man. It's definitely in my opinion. It, it, it can be unisex, but I think it leans a little bit masculine because of the woods and the base. And, you know, Woods kind of, it's a masculine note, in my opinion. But man, oh, yeah, I didn't even show the bottle. Look at the bottle. The cap, top, cool stuff. Atomize is good as well. Bottle looks great, great quality. All that. But, yeah, I, I like, this is, dare, dare I say, dare I say Club Dating Wheat Intense, man. You might have some competition when it comes to compliments. Club Dating Wheat Intense, man. Lafayette Street. Uh, Pacific Coast hasn't gotten me as many compliments as this. Uh, you know, Dear Savage still gets compliments. But I'm, I'm just telling you, like, this thing is, when well, you got something that's powerful and mass appealing, you put it into one fragrance, what more can you ask for, bro? This this definitely has quality of a uh, uh, designer. I think it high designer level, too. It's not even, like, it's not synthetic. It's not alcoholic blast. It's, it's really, really... A decent fragrance. One thing I will say though, this is labeled as a, a, a straight. I mean, a, a Edu Parfum, as you can see right there, Edu Parfum. To me, it it wears more like an extract because it's very oil based. Like if you spray this on your skin, you can see a strong like oil is there. I will put it on my skin, but hey, I'm trying to wear something else. If you if I put this on my skin, and even if I wash, it's gonna be there. But the it, the oil in this is so strong and dense that it just sticks to your skin and, and that's a good thing for performance but i'm just letting y'all know you spray this on clothes and ain't going nowhere so make sure you want this shirt to be made for this fragrance before you put it on but yeah man i get this fragrance it's a 10 out of 10 in my book y'all it's perfect it's perfect i got no complaints you can wear this any season any occasion compliment beast like versatile like what more can you say it smells exceptional nothing groundbreaking smell wise but just so dang mass appealing man so mass appealing $50 from the Ooh store y'all go check it out man definitely uh appreciate uh them finally sending me a fragrance because i ordered a, a latafa vintage radio and i never got it from them so they just ended up refunding me but they got this to me in a uh, good timing as well so shout out to them all right y'all but i love y'all stay blessed peace